Hey, what's going on everybody? Hope you're having a great day. And today got to start using my GoPro Hero 7 camera and shooting some 4K video. And I just upgraded to Camtasia 2018. Want to show you how you can export it in 4K. And it works as you can see here. If I come here to the options and you can see 4K right up here, which is great. And initially when it uploaded it, it was at 1080, 60 frames. And it just, after a little while, it finally went to 4K availability, which is awesome. So let me show you how you do this. So what you do is you click on and grab your file. So there's the video. And then I am gonna drop and drag here and then First, I'm gonna change this. What I do is change it to the 60 frames per second. So I am gonna come down here to project settings and gonna change that to 60. Now, the next thing, what you really wanna do for the 4K, just to show you, you can also change the 60 frames there. You'll see here, canvas dimensions. So what you wanna do is come down to custom and then you just wanna change the dimensions, 3840 and, oh, and then, let me Turn that on by 2160, click apply. Now you'll see the screen smaller. You could just come here and change the scale to 100%. Click um, and then that should go. Okay, so now it's at 100%. There you go, it's filled up in the box. So when, if you, when you actually export now, if you click share and you click local file, if you come here, you'll see here 3840 by 2160. And then you pick MP4. Now, the other thing too is if you hadn't changed it, you can change the frame rate as well as the size in this area here as well. Click next. And then you go ahead and produce your video. So that's pretty much it. Again, really excited that I got it working in 4K. So when I shoot those videos, and then if you want to you know, just shoot it in, you know, 1440p at 60 frames, you can adjust that sizing as well if you don't want to do 4K. So I hope this video is of help. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll continue to share some other tips that I learned from using Camtasia 2018, but it definitely is really nice for me going from version 8 to 2018. All right, everybody, have a great day. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Take care.